This video will cover the topic coterminal angles. Two angles are defined as coterminal if they have the same initial and terminal sides. In order for the angles to have these same sides, they must have the same coordinates, plus or minus a multiple of a revolution of the circle. One revolution of the circle is 360 degrees or 2 pi radians. So by adding or subtracting the revolution value with the appropriate units from our given angle, will this result in the coterminal angle? That's right. But furthermore, we may have to subtract or add a multiple of one of the values for the revolution, depending on the example problem. Let's look at an example now. Find an angle between 0 and 2 pi that is coterminal with 31 pi over 6. For this example, we would need to subtract a multiple of 2 pi, since the value is given in radians and is larger than 2 pi, right? Exactly. And to find the amount we need to subtract, we can convert the multiples of 2 pi to have a denominator of 6, thus yielding 4 pi, or 24 pi over 6, as the closest multiple to the given angle without exceeding it. So, by subtracting 24 pi over 6 from 31 pi over 6, we can yield our answer of 7 pi over 6 for the coterminal angle. This is starting to make some sense, but can we do an example where we're given a value in degrees next? Sure. Let's find an angle between 0 degrees and 360 degrees that is coterminal with negative 307 degrees. Since this value is below the given range, we need to add a multiple of 360 degrees to find the value of the coterminal angle, right? Exactly. Adding 360 to the given value yields 53 degrees, which is in between 0 and 360 degrees. Thus, our final answer for the coterminal angle is 53 degrees. Okay, I think I understand this topic now, but let me quickly summarize just to be sure. We begin by identifying whether the given value is measured in radians or degrees, and then if the given value is above or below the range we're asked to find the coterminal angle in. We then add or subtract a multiple of a revolution, 2 pi or 360 degrees, to solve for the value of a coterminal angle within the range given. That's right. 